That's it, Jim lad. Old ship shape and Bristol fashion. Well, not any more. What are you looking for, Ben? This! I'll be needing these, I will. Corks? Are we going to make coconut rum, Ben? <laughs> Such a question at your age. No, I need them for my chess game. Chess? You can't play chess with corks. They're all the same. <laughs> the wily devil thinks I'll trade my pawn for his bishop, he does. But old Ben is too smart for him. Devil? You're not playing with some evil spirit, are you, Ben? <laughs> there might be some who says he was, they might. But no, Jim Lad, old Black Jack Flack is as human as me. Who's Black Jack Flack? Black Jack Flack. <laughs> the saltiest sea dog ever set sail. Marooned on yonder island he is. <laughs> Plays a mean game of chess, but even the next move won't save him. But if he's there, and you're here... Let me see! Let me see! Quiet! You ridiculous rodent! Fine bottle, of course! This is great! If I'm not mistaken, this is Blackjack's next move. <laughs> Won't do him any good. No matter which way he turns, I'll checkmate him in two moves, Jim Lad. Let me see. Let me see. Come on, sir. Give us a turn. Not now! <laughs> well? What's he say? Patience, Jim Lad. Chess is a game of patience. <laughs> what is it, Ben? Oh dear, oh dear, oh no! Help! Black Jack Flack is in trouble, and only I can save him. Why? Because I'm the only one that knows him. No, I mean, why is he in trouble? Don't know. Didn't say. No, oh, I'd forgotten I was going to mend that. Well, there's more than one way to pluck an albatross. Wait! Ben! Ben! Chess lesson's gonna have to wait for another day. Bye, Jim. Ben! I'm your friend! I could help. <sighs> Two doubloons says that my sand crab will beat yours by a length. What doubloons? From the treasure. We ain't got the treasure yet. And those sand crabs ain't moving. I wonder if those crabs go well with a nice butter sauce. Mine one, pay me. When we get the treasure. Hmm? Then it'll be two doubloons plus interest. Ben Gunn's here to see you, Captain. I need to borrow your jolly boat. And do you now? And what's in it for me? <laughs> Goodwill for a good deed. Goodbye. What about a drill? I've got a drill. Then what about this lovely horn? A sweeter sound you'll never hear. Well, take it. No, we won't. I don't like music. Then what about this 12-pound cannonball? I've got plenty of cannonballs, but there is one thing I could use. Name it! You bring me young Jim Hawkins' map, and I'll let you have the boat. <laughs> you can't be serious! I am. You want the boat? Bring me the map. Never! Ben Gunn never betrays his friend. Sorry to take up your time. He didn't go for it, did he? He will. The scoundrel wanting me to steal a map. Ben Gunn's no common thief! Of course I could just ask them for it. Jim Hawkins might give it to me, he might. He's a good lad. 
but the others, the others, the squire, bah, he'd never give it to me. And the doctor, he'd want to know why, and then he'd want to help. But it's too dangerous, much too dangerous. <sighs> I could never risk them to... <sighs> dangerous. Today is mutton pie. The poor lad, dreaming of home. Somewhere it does. Aha! Thought you could hide on me, eh? Oh. oh, that was a weird dream. Last one up cooks breakfast, Squire. Three pounds and not a penny more. Not a penny, I say. <sighs> Dr. Livesey. Captain, come quickly, hurry! Jim? What? What's the matter? Are you all right? I'm fine, but the map, it's gone! Gone? What do you mean, gone? As in stolen, Squire. Stolen? Why, those evil pirates actually have the nerve to sneak in and steal our map! The outrage! This is intolerable! Jim, tell us what happened. I just got up and found the tree open and the map gone, and this was here. Not to worry, what goes around, comes around. It's signed B. Gun. How dare he come parading in here like, like a, a thief in the night? I, I'll admit the old boy is my touched, but he can't just take other people's property any time he pleases. This is intolerable. Oh, I'm sure it must be some kind of mistake. Ben would never... Why, I've a good mind to have a few words with him. A few strong words at that. Come on, Ben. Let's just see what that old rascal has to say for himself. Squire. Bless me for a fat old wheel, but this exertion will be the death of me. Why are we doing this? You wanted to give Ben a piece of your mind, remember? Ah, yes, and so I do, and so I shall. Can't we rest a bit? Almost there, Squire. Spread out. See if you can find him. Ben? Are you here? I think I may have found our map. I've lost him. There he is. That's it then, I'm afraid. It appears that Ben Gunn has betrayed us. I'm sorry, Jim. So am I. Sorry? Sorry? By the bishop's teeth, we'll see who's sorry. When I catch up with Ben Gunn, he'll wish he'd never laid eyes on our map. And when I get my hands on silver... <laughs> Perhaps sooner than you think. They're anchoring. Are they coming ashore? Not yet. It'll take them some time to decipher the map. Well, that'll buy us some time. Old goat 
to a sea dog sneaking into our camp? <sighs> well, I'll be hanged if I ever again go out of my way to help the poor and unfortunate one. Poor we are already, and we'll be unfortunate as well if you lead those pirates to our position. Captain Smollett's right, Squire. Do keep your voice down, or they'll be throwing cannonballs at us. I say, how quickly the unintelligent resort to violence. The squire's right. If the treasure falls into Silver's hands, they'll sail away and maroon us here forever. Perhaps, but I see no reason to give up so easily. By Jove, we'll show them a thing or two. I hate it when they sing that song. They sound so happy. They should be. They have the map. I can't believe that Ben betrayed us. I know. It's hard to believe. Ben always seemed so... so harmless. But I'm ready to give those pirates the fight of their lives. Yeah, me too. I'll see you later. Where are you going? Captain said we're spending the night here. I've got something to do. John Silver, where would I hide a map? Hide a map in a map. Oh no! Oh, which is which? Someone's been walking down here with little wet feet. Oh dear. Come out, boy, and I'll go easy on you. Know what we do with stowaways? The plank! The plank! The plank! Not the... you! Hawkins! Now come out, or I'll come in and get you! I'm losing my patience! Shoot fish in a battle. Go back to sleep. Get some rest. You'll need it in the morning. What you thinking, Captain? Thinking how nice a hot rat pie would taste right now. One move, and I'll roast your evil heart for breakfast. Jane! <laughs> Sorry, Jim. You're all wet. What have you been doing? I was out making a mess of things. What? Oh, I thought I could switch a fake map for the real one so everyone wouldn't hate old Ben. He's all right. He's just a little confused now and then. So I swam out to the Hispaniola and I left the fake. But Long John came back too soon, so I never got the real one. Well... It was a good idea. Oh, yeah, but what good did it do? None. Maybe he'll use the wrong map. Hmm, maybe. I'm going to get some sleep. OK. Good night, Jim. Stand and fight, coward! Jim. Jim. Wake up. They're coming 
the shore. Uh-oh. Silver and five, six pirates. Which way are they heading? North. Oh, then they got the right map. Jane told us. Remember, they've only got the map. They haven't got the treasure. And they'll only get that over my dead body. I'm sure Silver can accommodate you on that. I hate this boat. Shut up, or I'll make sure you're the first one to the bottom. Dear, oh dear. I hate this part. Shh. You'll hate it worse if they hear you. Go away, Nicodemus. You'll get no dinner here. Jack! Blackjack Flag! Blackjack! Where are you? 14, 15, 16. Here. Yeah. This is the spot. Well, don't just stand there like a bunch of ninnies. Dig! Yeah. They're digging. They've found something. I just knew that old rascal Ben couldn't be trusted. I guess not. Hutcher! Put your backs into it! No, mateys. We take it back to the ship, and then we divide it. They found the treasure. Everything we've risked and suffered for. Not if we fight for it. To the death, if necessary. Now, let's not be hasty. Perhaps there's an alternative to dying. I have a plan. Listen. Now, Captain. Captain! <laughs> Jack, you've met an awful end. So? Jack, he lived as he died. Rest in peace. Pew, pew, pew. Oh, land sakes, can't a body get a bit of a tan without someone spattering sand? Ben! Good to see you, you gamey old sea dog! <laughs> it's hard to believe we've lost everything to that swine. Double-crossing goat! I'll have his hide! <laughs> 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 
<laughs> I knew Ben wouldn't betray us. But where's the treasure, Captain? We've been double-crossed, you barnacle. I'll roast them all alive, and then they'll walk the plank. Then I'll fish them out, and they'll walk it again! Ah! 